Kerry, a nutritional display out there. You've stopped a, a run of defeats. Is that a fair result today? Yeah, I think it's a great result, of course. Uh, I felt like we had some opportunities to score, but um, I felt like they also had opportunities to score. But I think we did a great first half. I think also in the end, unfortunately, they got a penalty, but we came back, we got a penalty on our own, and um, I would say it's a fair result, but I think we also could have got the three points in the end of it. Mm -hmm. Was it a case of going back to basics today? Yeah, I think so. I felt like it's a way from, from we have had uh, three losses in a row now and I think for us to bounce back with one point now is good and now we have two home games after a tough schedule with a lot of good games in front of us. So, of course, I think this was a little bounce back for us. Mm -hmm. You were one of a number of players to have came back into the side. Was it a case of making an impression this was your chance again? Yeah, of course. I told also Juki were with me before the game also said if I get a penalty I will I want to take it. And for me, I'd rather be the loser than do nothing. And I felt like I had the opportunity and eventually I scored. So I'm really happy and buzzing for myself and also for the team. Uh, it's been Even if I haven't been in the squad for a few games now, I feel like the team has been really supportive to me and also my family and friends. Mm -hmm. What was the process, Karen, when you're not in the side and you're having to wait for your chance? You just have to be, remain ready and when you're called upon? Yeah, you get hungry all the time. You're always, <laughs> always ready for the chance that you get every minute that you get. So I've been working so hard every training and every time I get the minutes on the pitch now, I always try to do my best and help the team. And I felt like I had opportunity today. So. It was a great game for me. Mm -hmm. Like you say, when you come to a side, it's just two defeats here all season for Blackburn and you managed to take something from the game. It's something to build on now with so many games in the next couple of weeks. Yeah, of course. Uh, as I said, the tough schedule makes it also that the rotation with the players and you see now, even if the players that hasn't been playing so much coming in and do a terrific job and players been coming back from injuries also. So I feel like we have a great squad and I think we have uh, great opportunities now when we're two home games also. Mm -hmm. When you look at the players who have come in, it was five changes for, for both sides today. Does it take you a while to get going again? Is there some cobwebs to be blown off or was you straight back in? No, you're straight back in. You're training the whole 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 time. You had the preseason, and you have all of the games and everything. And I felt like the staff has made a great job for the players that hasn't been playing also uh, to get the job done and still be fit. Mm -hmm. Not every game is going to be a spectacle. It's not all about beautiful football at times. Yeah. And it was a bit, bit doggy and attritional out there. Yeah, this was a little, little bit different game with the pitch and everything. Uh, and it's a tough game, of course. It's away. And uh, I felt like we, we did really well. Is it a big importance to do that side of the game as well? It's OK when you've got the ball and in possession looking pretty. But there's the other uglier side of the game that we can't you know, just abandon for now. Yeah, sometimes those games happen also. Uh, but I felt like also, even if it was a tough game, I felt like we played a little bit when we came in, in the last third also. And there's where I feel like we are really good also when we have the combinations and a little bit of fantasy. Uh, the players do one-two with each other and do one we ones and stuff like that. So. Uh, of course, it becomes a different game plan also, but every game is different and it's a thing that you have to do and prepare for mm -hmm. before the games. You say every game is different. Next up, Leeds United. It's going to be a very different sort of opposition from them, but one you look forward to. Uh, yeah, of course. It's a great game. Leeds is a good team, but I feel like also we are really good at home and I uh, felt like it's going to be a really good game. <laughs> To it. It's four games now in nine days. You have to just remain fit and firing. Is it a case of the recovery being yeah. as important as the match days themselves? Yeah, the recovery is really huge. Uh, it's all about the food and everything. Uh, but I feel like we have have a lot of stuff here we can do to help that uh, with the medical stuff that help us keep us in shape and always do recovery. So it's a really important thing now when we have a tough schedule.